The next systems evolved through combined efforts at two different VFX studios. It's so great we, when we can all get along. Am I right, everyone? <laughs> These guys are like the Lennon and McCartney of rig-based solving. While at Image Movers Digital, Nick Ap Apostoloff had developed a rig-based solver called Face Mover. It was a data-driven approach. Meanwhile, at Digital Domain, Jeff Wedig had already been developing his own solver for Tron Legacy. His version was artist-driven, allowing them to choose which rig controls the solver should use. These developers were separated by hundreds of miles when fate intervened. Digital Domain acquired IMD's technology and Nick. And then one day, Nick passed Jeff in the hall, and in slow motion, they gazed into each other's eyes. And you know the rest. Yeah. This new design was used with spectacular results for the Pixies in Maleficent, and most recently for Colossus in the film Deadpool. The Academy presents a Technical Achievement Award to Nicholas Apostoloff and Jeff Wedig for the design and development of animation rig-based facial performance capture systems at Image Movers Digital and Digital Domain. We would like to thank the Academy for, and the committee for all their hard work. The investigation of these technical awards is no simple task, requiring time, patience, and a whole lot of technological prowess. This work often goes unacknowledged, but we thank you all for your time and effort in validating not just our work, but the work of so many other deserving projects. We're pleased to be part of the class of 2017 with so many other talented individuals. Congratulations, everyone. <laughs> Having some problems with the teleprompter there. <laughs> we all know that it's not just two researchers like us working in isolation that makes something like this a huge success, but a huge talented team of artists and engineers, the designers that create the crazy spandex outfits and helmets that we make our actors wear, the actors for agreeing to wear them, um, the, the motion capture technicians who run the stage, collect the data, wrangle it, and clean it, our mentors and supervisors who guide us along the way, the riggers who create the puppets, the modelers who sculpt the thousands of beautiful shapes, the animators who experiment and use our technology, the technical directors who make it all come together, and the researchers, those like us who create the crazy algorithms and put actors through hell so we can get their wonderful performances onto the screen. Thank you and congratulations to everybody at Image Movers Digital and Digital Domain who's been part of this project. Honestly, without all of the contributions from everyone, none of this would have been possible. I'd also like to thank my parents, my family, my extended family, my in-laws, my brother, um, who encouraged my creativity and curiosity by patiently answering the annoyingly endless stream of questions I had when I was a child, and unfortunately still have to now. Uh, most importantly, I'd like to thank my beautiful wife, Isla, who's over there at table number 27, who I see every day doing exactly the same thing with our gorgeous children, Karis and Dylan. I love you all to the moon and back. Thank you so much. I'd also like to thank my parents for showing me how to live my life balanced in the nexus between the technical and artistic, my brothers for developing in me the right kind of crazy, uh, my children, Bronwyn, Duncan, and Moira, who are my inspiration more than they can ever know, and most importantly, my wife, Kathy. So in 2004, when I told her I wanted to change professions and work in visual effects, she didn't say no. She didn't even look appalled, which I, was what I expected. And for that, I'll be eternally grateful. Thank you all. Thank you.